Take your fucking shitty, shitty fucking fedora and go eat a dick. Oh, did you ever know I'm fucking in here babbling, dude? Dude, I'm not even going to give you a trashing. I'm just going to answer your challenge. All right, let me get in. So, Jim Ram, apparently, those gonzo dudes, who I'll be starting my show there next week. Why did I, For some reason, I thought it was today, but they're like, dude, we said we're not starting until June 18th, and you're not starting until the Saturday after that. I'm like, oh, okay. So, next Saturday, you're going to catch my hour thing, 8.30, Saturday night on gonzo thing. Just an hour. So, Jaron, they I guess they sent a guy in a chicken suit to his house, which I think is fucked up. I don't have to just have a talk with these guys, though, dudes. We're not going to be sending people to people's houses. But let's not do that. <laughs> Jim and him and these dudes are on some next-level doxing shit. I find it to be, like, as an outside of observer, just funny kind of. <laughs> so they send this dude, and then Jim and him went nuts. He did that thing where he went off screen because he was probably crying or something. And then uh, he got weird. But then, oh, by the way, this confirms that I've now completely defeated German Am. Now he just wants to fight me in real life. He wants me to fight him. So, German Am, I accept your challenge to fight. If you get on an airplane from California and fly here, I will meet you anywhere in Rhode Island and beat you up. So there, you have your answer. I will fight you. Just come fly here, and um, I'll, we can do it any time. The dude really asked, said, I want to fight him in real life. You lose, by the way. That's the rules of the internet. The second anyone says I want to fight in real life, that's an automatic loss. But I, I accept your challenge. And get here anyway. Maybe fly here on a dragon. You people have those, I think. <laughs> um, I'd suggest taking off the sunglasses, but I accept your challenge to fight. I'm a pussy. I just accepted your challenge to fight. Come on, fly to Rhode Island and fight me. Yeah. You're the one who laying down the challenge. I accepted it. There you go. <laughs> but it was another, you know, he did lead. I don't know why. I mean, dude's doing... Six hour live stream that got less than 500 views. Well, let's keep it up. Make sure he throws the first punch. We don't need you to. No, I always throw the first punch. <laughs> always. <laughs> yes, that's a good. Trevor Snick in the chat says, Time to do a suicide, Jimmer. Great dishonor to your femory. <laughs> Where are Jimmer Nam's comments? Uh, through the periscope. But yeah, so Jimmer, Nam, I accept your challenge to fight. Bring it anytime, any place. Come to Rhode Island, I'll handle you. There'll be a thousand other niggas who I've beaten up. I doubt you've ever been in a fight. You're a geeky Asian guy. <laughs> Kyle, did you see any of Broke Bar's 12? You did a 12 hour stream last night? No, I didn't see another Broke Bar stream. <laughs> I, I don't. I. I catch this shit the next day and only if it's like about me. <laughs> like other I watch bigger wait like I've been checking out a bunch of Ice Poseidon shit. Holy shit they fucking swat that motherfucker a lot. God damn, I had no idea. <laughs> Feel bad for that dude. <laughs> your viewers don't you literally have someone named Wendy the retard on your shit? <laughs> oh no no no. Yeah, what you're cause you're in a... YouTube chat, so it looks like me posting it, but it's my bot doing it. It's uh, just posting his uh, Periscope things. Uh, no, you said me too, stupid. I listened to the thing. You said me, you want to fight me. Then you said you wanted to fight Broke Bar. And then you also said you wanted to fight those dudes. So unless you're trying to back out now, which I guess you are, you're trying to, because you know you couldn't handle this in any way, shape, or form, dude. And you know that, so. I'm I accept you backing out now. I accepted your challenge to fight, but now you're backing out and don't want to. So he really said fight me in real life. What a con. <laughs> but all right, pussy. It wasn't you. He's like, he's like that dude I confronted in school. And he's like, I wasn't talking to you. I met the guy behind you. No, I don't want to fight you. It's like, come on, dude. Stop being a pussy. YouTube fight club. <laughs> the first rule of YouTube... Fight Club is you do not stream YouTube Fight Club. Damn hundred dollar dono. 
Yeah, thanks to Austin Marinelli. Uh, you should go back later <laughs> and read the message you put with it. And the extra funny part is when the automatic thing reads it. Uh, I think I like that feature. I think the reason why it didn't work last night is because you swore in the message. I got to take off that it blocks nutty words. Did, wait, you're saying I'm as thin as broke bar? <laughs> okay. You think I'm thin, dude. <laughs> this dude. Oh, my God. This dude is reaching. Not to help his children, though. <laughs> what are you doing, dude? You're like 40. <laughs> what are you doing? You're a 40-year-old on the internet trying to fight people. <laughs> what are you doing, dude? Uh <laughs> Wait, Walker Paul says, Rook, I'm very hurry carry. <laughs> Why doesn't he just call in? I am. Yeah, my, my phone is right there. You could just call in, Jim and Amp. Yeah, he, he's not. Look, I've done two calls on Tef shit and on this shit. He got smashed twice. He can't fuck with me. He knows this. This dude knows he can't battle with me. And that's why he's blocked me from calling into his shit. Because he knows anytime he's calling. Give him a smash, you know, though. I really don't care. Like I said, like, there's really no gain in me beefing with dudes smaller than me. I I blocked you. You're in my shit talking right now. What are you talking about? <laughs> the, <is> a call. <laughs> the dude while talking in my chat says I have him blocked. What a weirdo. Of course he's scared. He's a pussy. But it's whatever. He doesn't have to. Is Jim and gayer than Danny Ross? Huh. Yes, I mean, Danny Ross is just a nut job. Jimmer is a nut job, too, but at least Danny Ross actually was in the business. My shit. Look at my last live stream. It has over a thousand views. You know that number in a, like an hour stream? <laughs> Your six hour streams aren't even hitting 800 views, dude. Jimmer Scam has push notifications. For, of course he does for us. I'm not even subscribed to Jimmer Nam. Shit. Jimmer Nam is in this chat, like, begging for attention. He told, he said he wants to fight me in real life. And then he Jim immediately Nam. said he didn't want to. <laughs> yeah, Jimmer Nam's not going to fight anybody in real life. He has to fight with his own soul and spirit before he has to take on the world. Fucking idiot. Shut up, Jimmer Nam. See, don't make my, bat, my trip bad with bringing up that fucking faggot. This picture is him and his face and his sunglasses. <laughs> Poor Jimmer. Poor guy. He's going shit. He's 40 years old. Playing with us on the internet. Sad. Donald Trump is sad. Yes, uh, Jimmer Nam said he wanted to fight me in real life. Then came in here and retracted the statement because he knows I'd destroy him. Yeah, so... <laughs> But every anytime you say you want to fight someone in real life on the internet, you immediately lose. Like Danny, like in the Discord that after Danny Ross quit in the stream, me and Smartphone interviewed him. He was like, "Where are you at, Cosmic Cam? Because I'm gonna come there and bust your teeth out." And I'm like, "Dude, Danny, come on. If you saw me in person, we'd laugh, hug, and go get a like." What are you talking about? <laughs> I know. You fucking fight. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this guy Neo brought up a good point. This guy's watching me on multiple platforms. I know. He's hit me from Periscope, Twitch. So, these are all the things, by the way, all the different things he puts into his own chat to try and up his numbers, his live view count. But then if you look at his live view count when his video uploads, you go, Wait, how did you have 70 people in your live chat, but your six hour live stream has 400 views? How's that possible? Oh, yeah, it's not. <laughs> He's Richie has. Well, yes, he does clickbait. Oh, shit. Richie might show up. Imagine if I get Richie on some fight me in real life thing. A fucking tattoo showing up to my house. <laughs> still the minnows going up against my feet. Like little minnows. Jim, I, he's still in here babbling. What are you babbling about, dude? So, wait. What are you mad about Anthony Cumia for? It, uh, just in general. Cause he's a, and he re-blocked my new thing when I said, see you at the Chip Live podcast. <laughs> okay, because he said, I'm going to do a stream today about Richie and Ant. And I was like, oh shit, did Ant do something new? But just general hate, just revisiting. This is general fuck Trump that dude. <laughs> you know, every time I get into a little Twitter battle with someone, I can't bring up, look how many shitty followers you got. Because I'm not, 
on my original Twitter over 1,300 followers because that piece of shit got it taken down. I found um, on uh, Jimmerdam's Twitter, he follows this uh, mass report thing on uh, Twitter channel for YouTube. Yeah. So basically you go to it and you're like, they're saying bad things. And then this channel will go with all its people and shit and mass report that video. So, Ugh, yeah. so it's like a, it's like a crime stoppers. Yeah, it's like one of crime but, stoppers. But like Jimmerdam follows them, so you know he uses them. We probably tried to get like oh, yeah. broke bar shut down yeah, like right. every day or so. Yeah. We got a great point by Jenkins Flames. He says, Cosmic, don't bash your phone situation. Jimmerdam is forty and his sister still pays his phone bill. <laughs> 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 and it's true. See? So <laughs> can you Poor Jimmerdam. It's like we, we make fun of him because we want him to get his shit together, you know? We want him to get his shit. I know. I mean, I honestly just feel bad for the dude. Like like I've said before, he's doing something he doesn't want to do. He just wants to do Howard Stern reaction videos, but now he's stuck talking to other 40-year-old losers. Yeah, They're doing six-hour live streams with, like, no he's topic. He's meandering. He's not looking at anything. He's just looking around, looking at his phone. He's, like, getting up and walking away. You can tell he probably thought this was going to be really cool. Like, now six months into it, he realizes, like, all oh, this fucking kind of sucks. You know, it's not making money. You I know. Fuck to work for. I bet you if you clocked it for more than half the live stream, he doesn't even appear on camera anymore. Like, he just puts up, like, some picture and then probably walks away and let the people on his Discord babble about their nothing lives. It's, it's sad. It's like, what do you, you have a goal trying to hit six hours every night? What are you doing, dude? I don't know. That's the Jim Renan thing. I have, I've been leaving him alone. I haven't checked out any shit. Me neither. I mean, shit. there's nothing really to check out over there. It's just. Oh, Slur is, uh, he's, uh, with uh, Gonzo Podcast at Cosmic is, he's really retarded. Ugh. Who, who did you hook up with this week, Kitty? He, I'm not gonna tell you that, Jimmer. That's every fucking episode. <laughs> Fuck that. that boring old. Uh, what a terrible show. Yeah. But no, you know what? I think it was Sam Hill. He told me I'm way too negative. Or no, it was Boost Market. He said I'm really good at talking about and what I don't like. So I'm gonna try to move away from. The chicken man, some guy in a chicken costume. Yeah, like, I think that's fucked up if they really sent a dude to Jim Renam's house in a chicken suit. This, like, I guess those Gonzo's dudes sent, like, a singing telegram guy. And he wore, like, a chicken suit or something to Jim Renam's house. Uh, <laughs> and, um, don't make me laugh. <laughs> yeah, so I guess they did that. And they really... And so... Jim and Ann, of course, you know, went off screen and got really dark. That's why I guess he had to delete his live stream from YouTube. He goes and he funnels like some wine and takes a handful of pills and gets on and just like, you guys want to mess with me? You don't know, you don't know how I get when I'm messing with. You know, Jim and Ann, he can turn to like dark Jim and Ann in a second. The globalist sent the chicken man to turn Jim and Ann freaking gay. <laughs> right, uh, right. Game of chickens. Uh, Jimmy and Nam, we're trying to get him to have children. Uh, obviously, the Chicken Man is a globalist, works for the Bilderberg Group and NWO, and uh, they went to turn Jimmy and Nam gay, and uh, it's a conspiracy. It's a conspiracy. Jimmy and Nam himself is a conspiracy. He's a CIA agent. That's why he always wears sunglasses. His real Gregory name is from Tyson's chicken. Tyson's chicken. Uh, his real, he's really Kim Jong Un's older brother. He's really a North Korean spy sent here. Can you believe Jimmy Nam attacked this? Bit? He doesn't like the Alex Jones bit. <laughs> yeah. He said it's like the only bit we have, but it's like it's amazing. Please let Cosmic Pod. Cosmic could what podcast on here anytime you want. I told Clickbait. I told any of those dudes, uh, like Clickbait and them. If you ever want to stream on my shit, go for it if you want to. If I'm not streaming, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> when exactly did Jim Renam say he's going to fight you in real life? Like, when did exactly Last night. Did he, like, he was on his stream. He was yeah. gone off the fucking red wine and Kalana pin. And he said, you know what? I'm going to fight that lispy motherfucker. Well, he was mostly talking about this dude, Jeff. But then he said, and you know what? Kyle Sane's entertainment... I want to fight you too, and I want to fight 
broke bar and I want to fight I these guys. And he was like, really, I want to fight you. I, I'm challenging. So I was like, all right, dude, fly here and I'll beat you up. <laughs> like, okay. um, I'm rolling around in poison ivy laughing at you. But then he came in my chat and immediately uh, said he didn't want to fight. Wait, what did he say? What's up? He did really rebut with What did he say? I will fight you. I'll fight you in the street. I'll fight you in the bushes. I know karate. Come on, bitch. <laughs> who is that? <laughs> a guy who does a great Jim and Ham impression. <laughs> We, you know what's fucked up is we know who that is. They just won't tell us. It's one yeah. of the regulars in the chat. Dude, fun. Joe Cox, like I told Jim and Ann, fly here from California and I'll gladly beat you up. <laughs> but, yeah, don't, make, don't waste that type of money to Rhode Island to get knocked out. That doesn't even <laughs> right, so he doesn't have the money to waste. What is he talking? That's why the second you say, oh, let's fight in real life on the internet, you lose. Jim and Ham took like karate for like half a year in the 80s. He's probably not a force to be reckoned with. But he's a tall Asian, right? That's like his thing, right? He's tall. I don't think he's tall. I always thought he was like a 6'1 Asian. Oh, you're tall, no. right, Sans? No, I'd say I'm like 5'11, 5'10, okay. somewhere I'm around there. I'm, balls, dude. I'm just thinking somebody's tall. I just I thought Jim and was tall. Though. No. Maybe it's the sunglasses that makes him look tall. <laughs> so, um, but thanks everyone. Like I said, Richie, you're free to come back or talk about it anytime, but get your excuse ready. Jim and Am, I accepted your challenge, even though you just backed out. And uh, fuck Trampa, he's a piece of shit. <laughs> And remember, guys, we're just infinite love and light living on the universe, so be kind to each other. That's Cosmic, not me. Fuck y'all. <laughs> Cosmic Brother Cam, coming in from the moon. Was that another one in the camp? Yeah, they can still hear us talking about just playing, like, the Star Wars thing off. <laughs> Oh, I got shit to do. My water Well, they were just out there earlier, probably gonna bring them out again. Yeah. Of course, and me too. I fucking love those things. They rule. They rule. There must be a way they're making them.